All right, it's MLB draft night in real life. Uh, to be honest, I've never been much of a draft guy. I'm just not smart enough for that. Listen to a YouTuber, TF Twins, covering my Minnesota Twins, but couldn't pretend to know a darn thing. Instead, we're going to focus on our players. Hey, some development for me. What do we got? Two junk. One accuracy minus one velo. I don't want to lose any velo. Come on, now, don't do that to me. All right, uh, Victoria Daniels, we could give her some power, some speed, and some fielding at the risk of a RBI zero. Oh, that's the same one we looked at. I don't think we're doing that. All right, Gary Towers, who is not that committed to the guy, to be straight up honest with you. I would give him three contact and a... Mm, fine. Fine. Not that committed to the guy, but... We'll take the improvement to the contact when we do need him behind the dish. Not thrilled about spending so much money on him because now we're broke. Well, here's what it is, I guess. We're going to play Boston today, and Lily Rocket going to be headed to the hill for us. Tense day for Miss Daniels, and she should be at first. You're going to have to play through it, kiddo. I'm sorry. Locked in. I mean, look at this lineup. We're just... I think we're going to leave the batting order. I kind of like it where it is. Let's do this. Another daytime game. Battery Bay continuing the homestand. Always good to see that. And here the hashtag squeaky chair. The stands are filling up here at Battery Bay. Filling up indeed. We got another home game. Those blue unis looking good as we get ready to take on the magenta of the Boston Magic who are struggling this season. We have been up to good things and you know what I did forget to do before we start this ball game because we won our last one. I don't believe I upped our ego so we are going to cruise to 45 and we're going to 57 on pitching. I'm feeling brave today. Lily hasn't let us down. <laughs> A little bit of fear in the hearts of Boston. Lily Rocket. First pitch is outside and we are underway from Battery Bay. Here's Lily's second pitch. Too low and 2-0 and oh to start the ball game. Lily. On the ground and foul. So she gets a good result. Not quite the one we want, but that's all right. Going to go for... A little slider action here. Ooh, not the one, not the one. First time tonight, Lily has that walk-prone trait active. And a swing and a miss. All right, two-strike count. Full count for Lily Rocket. Here it is. Swing and a miss. And Lily picks up her first K tonight. Number seven, Lacey Johnston. Here's Lacey Johnston now. Lily, a little bit of a tense start to this one. To Johnston, the pitch is in there on the two-seamer. And there's a foul ball there, so Lily trying to get it done. That one too high. All right. Throw a good one, Miss Rocket. On the ground, first base. That is going to get fair. And going to be trouble along single. So the magic. The getting something to brewing. Here's Espinoza with some text to speech software in the text, uh, in the voice. That's kind of funny. I'm going to work on that one, Metalhead, but that's all right. Oh, Lily, come on now. Fire one in there, don't you? There it is. Fouled away, but that's all right. Beautiful slider swung on and missed. Two balls, two strikes, two outs. The pitching is feeling much more challenging. Fouled away, and we'll do it again. How about some uh, off-speed action from a Lily? Here it is. And fouled away. Man. Whoa, come on, be nice. 
And the fastball fouled away, and Lily is feeling the pressure a little bit to start this ball game. That one's on the ground. Playable, throwable, outable. A couple outs in the first. And here's Regan now. All right, Lily trying to keep up some positive momentum. I'm feeling the challenge of the pitching for sure. Trying to put him where we want to is not easy. Plenty of time there. Retires the magic in the first. So a goose egg. Not an easy goose egg, though. Hit given up and quite a few pitches thrown by Lilly. But bring up the bats, and they're in a good state. So we'll see how we go. And to start it off, here's Melody Ferguson as she steps in at home. Oof. Swings that one she maybe shouldn't have. Swing in late, and it's 0-2 on Melody. That one's inside. Melody to left center field. That is going back. Not far enough, however, in front of the track, and she is retired on the fly ball. Layla Uptown steps in and uh, has been playing well. Takes one in the zone for strike one. And that is going to get down and be fair. She's going to try to be in at second base, and she's going to be thrown out. Trying for two. Got down the line, just didn't get down there far enough. And here's Victoria Daniels with two gone. First one is in there. Popped foul. And Victoria's going to have a little single to keep the inning alive. So hopefully helps with that tension. Canopy Cannon now. Ah, oh, strike. Canopy Cannon launches one. Center field. Going back. Far enough? No. And that's going to do it. Canopy gave that one a ride. It was not to be. So we are still scoreless as we move to the top of the second from Battery Bay. Number 10, Bento Resplendent. Oh my gosh, Resplendent. What a name. And uh, what a name indeed. That is hit to center field a long way. And that's going to get down out there for a double, if not more. It's just going to be a double. So leadoff runner on second for Boston. All right, here's Ethan something. You know the drill, I can't read the names, don't come after me. All right, Lily, trying to get it done against Ethan, the pitch. That slider, Gary had to stand up and go catch that one in the air. A foul ball and a two-strike count for Lily Rocket and trying to finish off a batter here. She hasn't had a strikeout yet, and she won't have one there. Swing and a miss, and she will have one. One pitch later, Lily comes back with the cheese. Here's Miranda and Lily trying to do some damage. I like Jose Miranda. That's one of the twins. All right. A foul ball, Lily. Trying to kind of get it going and keep it going. Foul ball on the ground. And that's going to get through, and that could score the first run of the ball game. There's going to be a play at the plate. It's not going to be nearly in time. And the Boston Magic lead by a run here early. Number 16, Naya Meadows. Naya Meadows now one already in and just one gone here for the Magic. Lily throwing one low and too low. Fouled away and it's even up. And a ball and a strike. And a strike. Lily trying for another strikeout. A wicked two seamer, not quite enough. And what do you go for for the put out? A 
Slider that just caught the zone. Lily got lucky on that one. And a strikeout for Lily. So she's working herself into trouble. Number 35, Jace Gray. Here's Jace something. Grain, brain, crane, the pitcher. And the throw is in time on the grounder, so just one given up. Dude, I don't want to taste any tires. That's disgusting. All right. Only thing I want to taste is victory. And it won't be on a pitch like that. Happy swinging at calamities and swinging another one. Going to be gone on a can of corn fly out to left center field, barely out of the infield. Lamo battery is in there now. Man, I can't swing for nothing. Blamo gets a hold of one, and that's about to suffer the same fate. Can of corn, center field, right center a little bit. Two gone in a hurry. Number 96, Gary Towers. Gary, down the line. That's getting down. Get back, long single on the weird little hit there, but keeps the inning alive. That's all you can do. Molly O'Connor to left field, that's got a chance. It's going back, and she's gone. <laughs> oh man, we just can't catch a break. Still one nothing. Here's Jefferson Lane, I think. Sounds like a rock star. All right, a strike there. On the ground. Plenty of time to make the play, and there's one going. Number seven, Lacey Johnston. Lacey Johnston, back in there. Lily's first pitch on the ground, just about the same play, and two quick outs for Boston. Number 22, Navy. Espinoza. Here's Espinoza, also known as Text to Speech. Outside to Text. Calling you that now. And you can't stop me. A pop out. Text to Speech ends the inning for the Boston Magic. Still a one run lead as we move to the home half of inning number three. And here is Lily Rocket to lead it off. She's been known to make contact, and she does so there. She'll have herself a single to lead off the inning. All right, here's Molly. Melody. All right, trouble indeed. That one's going to travel to the wall, and they're going to be at second and third with nobody out. Double for Melody. And here's Layla with a chance to tie it up, if not take the lead. Uptown. Stands in. First pitch is outside. 1-0 to Layla. Just inside. 2-0 to Layla. That's apparently not in there. 3-0 to Layla Uptown. And they're loaded. Layla stands patiently, takes her walk, and... All three are occupied. For Victoria Daniels, you want a situation that would get you out of some tension. Here it is. That one is in there to Victoria. And she finds some grass. So a hit's going to bring in a run, tie the ball game, and they remain loaded. Victoria Daniels does her job. And here is a big bat, Canopy Cannon. Takes the first pitch high. Probably could have gone for the plate, but I wasn't sure what buttons I was pushing, so not going to worry about it. Happy K is in there, still loaded. 
that's got a chance at two could end the inning and will so happy K's promptly messes everything up but the bullets get one and we are tied moving to the fourth here's Regan Lily trying to do good things here as she continues her outing pops the first pitch playable and gone Number 10, Resplendent. Resplendent? What a name. All right, couple outside the zone to start the at-bat. Lily takes that one, it's foul. Not takes it, but you know, serves it up and it is then struck foul. Good pitch. Hit on the ground. The throw is in time. Two quick outs for the Magic. Ethan Meza. Ethan Meza. I want to play her, I want to find a Maisie Meza. I think that'd be a good name in Super Mega Baseball lore or, or whatever you call it, I suppose. Oh, wicked pitch and swung on and foul on the way. Lily trying for another strikeout, and she will have it. It's out of the inning. Well, there's zero on the board for Boston. Looking at the dugout there for the Bullets, and we're ready for the home half of inning number four. Blamo Battery stands in. Fouls one away in a hurry, it's 0-1. Blamo pops it up. And plenty of time to gaze at it, figure out where it's going, and catch it. So quick first out. Here's Gary Towers now. Takes one inside. Gary Towers, left field. If it stays fair, it's got a chance. And it's fair and it's gone. Gary Towers just hit a twisting home run. It's now a one run lead for the Bullets. Here's Molly O'Connor. Molly to right center field trying to do the same thing. She's got a little too much air. But it will get down, and Molly slides into second with a double to keep the inning alive. Lily. Trying to do something. Pops one foul. And she has a whack. And I double, I, I bumped. This is a really dumb reason for ending the inning. I just repotted a plant, and I have a slightly larger pot in its place. And the spot that I was resting the controller was right on the run button. Uh, and so that was my own fault, uh, and also the fault of a small snake plant. So, my bad. Here's Poppy, or Hoppy, or Hippity Hoppity, or whatever your name is. You're getting struck out either way. Doesn't matter to me what that letter is at the front of your name. Oh, don't give me that. I'll take a ground out in place of a strikeout. That's fine, I suppose. Naya Meadows. Playing the hot corner for the Magic. Lily's first pitch he has hit a long way to left center field and caught. Pitcher number 35. Jace Gray. Jace Gray, the pitcher, stands in. Plenty of time on the can of corn handled there to end the half of the inning that just belonged to the Magic. So you are still looking at a 2-1 lead for the Boardwalk Bullets as we move to the bottom half of inning number five, wherein Miss Melody Ferguson will lead it off. Trying to do something about it. 
Hits that to left field. That's got airs. A little too much up, not enough out. And gone is Melody on the play. Layla's going to pop up, do the same thing. And she's gone. Victoria Daniels is going to have a fair ball. Get back to first, please. Okay, no throw over. She got lucky. The left fielder, number 13, Canopy Cannon. Canopy Cannon launches one out there and ends the inning on the pop-out. So to the sixth, we shall move. Lily's still pitching decently well. Nowhere close. 2-0 to Jefferson from Lilly. Swing and a miss on the two steamers. So Lilly looking to try to uh, use a little deception. And 2-2. Two and two. Bless you. And a high pop-up. going to get foul so we will do it again two and two Lily Wines kicks fires hit to right field trouble back there not quite trouble enough and an out number seven Lacey Johnston Lacey Johnston hits one on the ground and that's going to get through so she'll be on first all right, here's text to speech now with one on and one gone. Chance at a double play. Second one, first is not in time. So two gone, runner at first. Text to speech managing to use the speed of word processing to evade the throw. And that's going to evade the outfielders and become a fair ball. And the throw is going to come into the plate. The play not in time. And tied is this ball game. Here's Desplendent now. Trying to follow one away and 0-1. And one. one and one. Lily fires one in the low zone and... That is foul, not by much. Lily tight ropes out of there, and two, two count. Two balls, two strikes, two outs. Lily to Gary. High and just managing to get a piece. Swing and a miss. Lily picks up a big one. So the game is tied. We move to the home half of the sixth. Two runs apiece. Now batting, center fielder, number 60, Happy K. Happy K's hits one foul. That's got air. That's got time. Happy's gone. Blammo battery golfs one foul. Then takes one. 0-2. Oh, and, and sizzled a little bit as it got down out there, and it's going to run to the wall. Going to have a couple of bases there as battery, and a one-out double. Gary is going to have a big old nothing. Here's Molly O'Connor with a runner on first, two gone. A weird play that was. Swing and a miss by Molly. Get foul and it will. Two and two. Low, three and two full count to Molly. Molly to right field foul, plenty of time under this one. And that's going to do it for the Bullets in the sixth. Well, seventh inning, Lily 
trying to get it done and won't have it on the first one to Ethan. Fouls that one away and trouble. Swing and a miss. Lily in a 1-2 favorable count. Swing and a foul. So we'll do it again. That one is outside the zone there. Well, Lily in a full count now. And an out. Good catch out there. Number six, Hoppy Miranda. Hoppy Miranda now, and Lily just trying to keep this score tied and hope for our first walk-off of this series. If we can keep it right where it is, we've got a shot. The throw is in time. Two gone. Number 60. Here's Naya Meadows. And a little fumble. The throw is not going to get... Well, it is going to get Naya. A little bit of a slow poke. Oh. Ouch. Brutal. Well... Lily, you've pitched a heck of a complete game to keep us in this one. Unfortunately, we're going to go to the pen here, or the bench, rather. And we're going to go with Jacqueline. Jacqueline Jackson. Jacqueline Jackson to left field. And going to be retired, so the move doesn't pan out. Melody Ferguson will have a single. So one gone. Melody on base. Here's Layla. And station to station they will go. No! Get back! Okay. Man, the snake plant strikes again. Victoria Daniels, two on, one gone. All right, 2-0. That's the one to hit, Victoria does so. Everyone's gonna stay put. Two gone. Canopy Cannon in the box. Takes one low. Canopy has a hack. Back it goes. Back a little more. And that could win it. Winning run coming in. And ladies and gentlemen, you've got your first walk-off of this series. Canopy Cannon does his job with a walk-off RBI. And there it is. Final score, your boardwalk bullets, three runs on 13 hits. No errors, two on five with no errors. So we struggled a little bit in this one, but we did get the win. Here's a look at the big numbers if you'd like to check that out. A good one, to be sure. If we go ahead and look at our pitching uh, records here. The... Uh, excuse me, the win is going to go, of course, to Lily. And it was kind of an odd game, but she went seven innings. Gave up five hits, two runs. Both of those earned no walks, five strikeouts. And that ERA for Lily going to drop to a 4-6-6. Six, six, and a 5-2 and two record for Lily. Man, look at those MVPs. A lot of folks in blue. That's what we like to see. And among them, Victoria Daniels. Hopefully she'll get out of that tense mindset. And uh, there we go. I didn't look at the other two. My mistake. But I saw Gary Towers in the second place. Didn't see who was in the first one. You'll have to ingratiate yourself with that knowledge. So there it is. Man, what a game. Glad we finally got a walk-off. It felt like we were due. Seattle in Miami. And who else? New Orleans at the Flyers. And... Oh, whoever that is, I can't see that one. Pepper Ducks, and probably the Herd, or some of those logos, I made them so dark, they're hard to see. Is that Detroit? Might be Detroit. Pepper Ducks, 
playing host to Austin, I believe, is what that was. Maybe not. Kansas City and Colorado. Uh, Lakewood. Hugoton. And then the Boston. Brooklyn and the Firecats doing battle in L.A. Or San Fernando. Um, the Tide hosting and... Brooklyn and the Hamburgers doing doing battle of the Northeast there. Firecats and the Pepper Ducks. Ouch, 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 ouch. Lots of games here. Brooklyn and the Flyers, low scoring. Firecats and the Pepper Ducks again. Firecats and somebody else entirely. Detroit, I think. Lots of games to get through here. We must be towards the back end of the schedule for this one. We got Brooklyn again. Brooklyn's playing a lot of games. What's going on here? And the Stationers at Seattle. And the Tide. My goodness, the whole league's got to play before we get our shot, huh? Goodness gracious. All right, well, we are going to really continue this homestand past what should probably be allowed, but that's okay. We are doing well. Well, Dodge City coming in at 15 and 11. We are 11, or 17 rather, and 9. So I don't forget, we're going to have the ego of 46, and we're going to go 58 for pitching. There it is. And, uh, well, Dodge City going to send to the mound Remy uh, b -b 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 Shipwright. And bringing the heat is Remy. On the opposing tide side, rather, we will see Wedge Villagas, who has a 104.91 ERA for us. A 3-2 and two with a 2 ERA, so some trouble on the pitching front. On the Dockers side of the baseball, we'll see that in our next one. Wow, we are really coming down to it. 17-9, and nine, so that puts us at 26. That means we got, what about... Uh, blah, 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 six or so more games, so we'll take a look at some player development opportunities and that sort of thing. See what we're doing. And much more in the next one. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, queries, ideas, or anything else, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comments section. We'll see you against Dodge City. Peace. <laughs>